Hi, um, I'm going to show you how to draw um, a raggedy rose like the one we have on the left here. Um, I'll just select that and delete it for now. Um, just go to the left hand panel and select the draw free hand tool and start to draw a roughened circle. Some dips coming in out. There you go. Now if that's not the shape you quite like, you can always select it again and go to the nodes tool and just start playing around with the nodes until you get to the shape that you're happy with. You can delete some of the nodes if they're in the way. That will do for now. Let's select it again. And we're going to go to the duplicate window and we're going to rotate five copies. Now just select any one, press down your Shift and Alt key and drag in a rough and circle to the centre. Just do the same to all of them except bringing them in little less each time. Right, there's your uh, raggedy rows. Now what we're going to do now is separate them out cutting purposes actually the card I've only got in my cutting machine at the moment is A4 size so I'm just going to change that to A4 uh, landscape it now means that my shapes are too big for the paper so I'm just going to select them all and just reduce them in size a bit and just place them so they will fit on. I'm using 160 gram at the moment, 160 GSM. Um, I don't know what it is in USA size, I apologise for that. So just send this to your norm, uh, normal cutting settings. Um, I've chosen, let's have a look, what have I chosen? Uh, blade to depth 3 and um, just a speed of 4 and a thickness of 33 um, it's basically a light cardstock that's what you want to choose okay then just cut away um, the, the, the rest of the video is going to be still shots of how I actually um, made this rose into an embellishment using um, distress stains um, made it into a little rose, added a bit of glitter and there you had a tattered rose for your crafty endeavours. So um, thank you for watching, I'll speak to you soon.